Hi, I'm Edna Ipayal. I am from the Philippines, from Mary Johnston College of Nursing. And uh, it's the institution that the United Methodist Women established in 1906 when uh, Dr. Rebecca Parrish came to the Philippines and established the hospital and the School of Nursing. And since then, the hospital has grown to be um, a level three hospital, complete services serving the people of Manila and the nearby provinces. And the College of Nursing has uh, flourished also and uh, educating not only women, but also men. However, the more important uh, program is to educate the women to uplift their uh, society in the their level into the society um, we are a small school we are not a huge university but we continued on with the mission of dr. Rebecca Parrish of healing education and outreach primarily for the mother and children but it has grown now the education ministry of Dr. Parrish is to send young girls to school to become nurses so that they will be in the ministry of healing. You know the ministry of the United Methodist Church is not just on the church. Dr. Rebecca Parrish um, plays it outside the church to those who are not coming into the church but needs also the saving grace of Jesus Christ through the ministry of healing. And that mission is uh, still going on until now. We now have a scholarship for the nurses. We have scholarship for high school young girls. We're in um, teenagers who couldn't afford to go to school are being helped so that they will be able to finish their high school education. We also have um, outreach ministry for the children, particularly the feeding program for malnourished children. You know what? It's not going to save hundreds or thousands of kids. But you know our mission? One young girl to finish a nurse, become a nurse will become successful in life. One young girl to finish high school will have a better opportunity. And one hungry child to be able to be fed will be a nourished child, and a nourished child will have a better future. And mothers who are educated will be able to take care of one family. If we can only have one girl, we know we have transformed life. Thank you, United Methodist Women, for establishing us. And we owe it to you. And we bring to God the glory because of you. Happy birthday, United Methodist Women.